Hello and uh, welcome to a new video. Today I'm gonna present you a new release from a house which I like very much, the house of Zoologist. I already have B from them, so I am a big fan of the Zoologist from Canada perfume house. And on Friday, on the 3rd of December, they have released a new perfume called Seahorse. This is how the packaging looks like. It opens like this. The perfumer is Julian Raskine, which is one of my favorite perfumers who created Fidelis from Histoires de Parfum or The Moon from Frédéric Mallet. If you can see, the box has this holographic effect. So it's quite interesting. I already removed the bottle from uh, the packaging and this is how the bottle looks like. It's the typical zoologist bottle. This should be a limited edition. It has this beautiful green gradient which reminds us of the sea. This is how the presentation looks like. It is an aquatic sweet perfume and after smelling it a bit today I can tell you that it reminds me of squid also from zoologist. This is an unisex perfume. It has an aquatic theme, of course, it's the seahorse. And I already tried it today, so I wore it to go out uh, uh, for a bit. And then I came back and I felt it uh, the whole journey. So it has a good sillage. It is very good for warmer days. Now in these colder times, it's not a perfume that is suitable for outside. And I will spray it now and we'll go through the notes a bit and then I'll tell you what I think about it. It has a very powerful start. So you would have Guatemala cardamom, fennel, umbred seed, clarisage, tuberose and neroli. So summary type of notes as a middle note. And in base notes you will have algae. So it really has this algae similar smell, vetiver and ambergris. I can tell you from the start that the fennel smell is very powerful. If you ever have tried fennel tea, you know that it has this very spicy aroma. So this spicy aroma of the fennel is also here. And to be very honest, the initial spray, the initial blast, I don't really like it so much. So like when you spray it at the beginning and almost takes over everything. But after about 10, 15 minutes, it gets toned down and then you'll have the next notes and it will become this very beautiful aquatic almost next to the sea smell which is also the theme of the perfume it's a seahorse and it's so nicely blended that uh, eventually the bitterness of the high quality vetiver which i can smell in here tones down this spiciness from the fennel and it becomes this round aquatic summary type of smell. I like it very much after like 10-15 minutes it becomes like a very nice smell which I would like to wear even now in these colder days. With squid, I think squid is a bit aquatic but too sweet for my taste. I also have a sample of the squid. It doesn't give me the same desire to wear the perfume like this one but this one is very nice and it has this sweet aquatic smell like algae and neroli and cardamom but it's also mixed with a bit of harshness from the vetiver and ambergris i don't smell it so if you expect some ambergris type of smell like an ambre nuit from dior it will not be the case but guys like after 10 minutes after the initial spray it becomes such a nice perfume. So occasions where you can wear this. By these beautiful sweet aquatic notes I think it's very well suited for going out or for your free time to wear as a perfume. This is not a perfume that I would see worn in the office or at work or if you have meetings with clients unless you are I don't know in real estate and you want to have let's say an extrovert type of smell but unless you are in in something that requires you to have this extroverted type of uh, approach to your your clients or your business partners this is not a, a perfume for that it is very well suited for ladies and for men i see it as being a, 
unisex indeed and the longevity is quite decent so I have this perfume since today in the afternoon I sprayed it a bit and I can tell you that um, on the jacket it's still noticeable so this would be around seven hours on clothes with two sprays this extra de parfum is really holding well the price is 195 euro depending where you get it from probably in the US will be about 220 dollars or something similar it is advertised as a limited edition I don't know if once the stock is gone there will be others maybe it's really one off and that's it we'll see and uh, I'm really happy to say that I like it very much. If you go after those 5-10 minutes when the fennel is very spicy, very in your face, you will get a nice surprise with this aquatic, beautiful, sweet, playful, summery type of smell. Please comment down below what is your experience with Zoologist perfumes or with the perfumes created by Julien Raskine. Also tell me what is your expectation from this perfume. I hope you enjoyed this very short introduction into the Zoologist Seahorse limited edition and I hope to see you soon on the channel again. Bye bye!